Take a look at this AliExpress module and it costs around 14 US dollars and the price will be different in different countries but I noticed something by the time I received the product or the module they upgraded they make a newer version take a look and what is the difference you will find out very soon and what is it it's a new 30 watts this one is 220 volts I ordered it that works on DC 12 volts or 24 volts amplifier board audio car Bluetooth amplificator USB DAC what does, does it mean FM radio micro SD player subwoofer DIY amplifiers for car for home okay I ordered it and of course I got it no bubbles come on what's wrong oh, it's good that it come in another box Let's cut it see the difference never mind never mind it's here and I like it beautiful amplifier module with Bluetooth enough enough so what is the difference this module that I'm holding in my hand works only on DC voltage 12 to 24 volts on the new version they have add that can work with direct line from AC 110 to 240 volts besides that you can run on DC voltage also you can power it by AC voltage 110 to 240 volts beautiful the link will be in the description in below so you can check it let's see it in 360 yes on the new version comes together with the remote control that I didn't get it and also the AC power cord it says it has a Bluetooth memory card 3.5 millimeter audio jack or cable loud volume all right so let me explain some stuff about this module which is amplifier hi-fi mp3 player this wire is the antenna for the fm tuner yes it have also a, a fm tuner the main power switch is right here we have three buttons for for controlling the mp3 songs play previous and next also on these buttons you can control the the volume all right we have the infrared sensor that is for the remote control that I don't have it the micro SD card reader with the USB we have a DC jack for powering the device that works it says from 12 volts to 24 volts we have left and right right channel channel audio input and we have three potentiometers for adjusting the the sound that is volume treble and bass and from behind everything is very well made only we need to attach these two cable connectors on these connectors that is the output two times by 15 watts and you can see right here 
that they are missing some electronic components and that is I think for 2.1 model this is only left and right stereo but it comes probably in 2.1 model the small antenna for the Bluetooth and that's it it's nice module this one you can place it on your box with your speaker and it, it will look nice all right time for testing attaching the second speaker okay and these are old speakers but I'm gonna I'm gonna use it for testing all right okay powering with 12 volts okay nothing happens that is okay and in three two one line in mode Ooh, great it's working that is the first good sign that is working okay let me hold this fm mode, FM mode. Line in mode. First, I don't want to scan any FM stations because I can get copyright strike. I'm gonna insert the micro SD card with my very bad MP3 songs. But what I can do, this is just for testing. Line in mode. Music play mode. You can control the volume with these push buttons, but also you can control with the potentiometer for volume, for the bass and treble. Try the line in mode. And yes, it's working. Also, you can add some volume on the potentiometer and you can mute the sound with the play or power button. Take a look. Power off, power on. Line in mode. Line in mode, yeah. Beautiful. It's working fine. And the final test is connecting with the Bluetooth. And as you can see, it's working fine. Take a look. I'm gonna. like today presentation of this very cheap and cool audio amplifier module that you can place it on in your uh, speaker box and my version is working only on DC voltage but there is a new version with AC voltage powering also and I suggest to get that board or that module and that's it thank you for watching Please give a like, share and subscribe to my channel. See ya!